Good morning. It's Monday, August 15th. Thanks for kickstarting your week with Top Story. Head over to the full Worldwide show to check out stories like these. Illinois attempts to improve the public image of a voracious invader. And Hannah reports on women in Afghanistan one year after the Taliban's takeover. Now, this is Top Story. Crowds gathered this weekend at the border between India and Pakistan. They were there for a yearly ritual marking the rift between the two countries. That border was created 75 years ago on August 14th. The ritual includes national songs, flag waving and chanting. It ends in brotherly handshakes, but things haven't always been peaceful. India and Pakistan can never be friends. Even if Pakistan extends an arm of friendship, it will soon stab India in the back. India and Pakistan used to be one British territory. In 1947, the UK relinquished control. Local leaders decided to split the territory into India, which was mostly Hindu, and Pakistan, mostly Muslim. That move triggered massive riots and violence as people fled from one country to the other. 12 million Muslims and Hindus found themselves on the wrong side of the border. About one million were massacred. Newly divided, India and Pakistan disagreed about who got the region of Kashmir, and still do to this day. The countries have fought three wars and engaged in dozens of skirmishes. Still, India and Pakistan share deep cultural and linguistic links. Lots of people had died during partition. We never want that to happen again. Make sure to check out the full site at worldwatch.news. You can try out the show free for a week. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. I'm the Big Bash. Remember, whatever the news, the purpose of the Lord will stand.